Well, hey there, this is Bergamot here. Seems we got ourselves into a bit of trouble. I guess that's a goblin peeking out to see who's invading this here tower. Maybe we should have found the back door. Well, let's get going. Time to drink and dungeon, y'all. You start moving in, and you look up in the two uh, arrow slits in the wall, and you see dark heads come up, and you see their little gleaming eyes, and you see and I'm like, big <laughs> smiles open up. Like, like oh, Cheshire no. Cat, right? Yeah. yeah. And um, give me a uh, acrobatics check as well. Mm, I got this. <laughs> hold, my, hold my wine from the elves. I got this. Nine. Nine. All right, you start to slip a little bit, but but uh, you do not slip. Okay. Yeah. Are they shooting at me yet? No, not they're just yet. smiling. Mm. Maybe they like you. Oh. We, we, um. So far, you're the first female they've seen in a long us? time. Hmm? Tell us, maybe, so he can get his arrow. Oh yeah. I need to go back and tell them. You need to shoot arrows. Yeah. I need to go back and tell them. Yeah, I'm not quite at the right angle. Okay. Goblet, we're, we're found out. We've Grim been had. Gremlins. Gremlins, no one here. Uh -huh. Guys, I guess I'm gonna go in. Yeah, oh. if you will move me to where I am. In the doorway. To where I can. Oh whoa. Um, to where okay. my line of sight allows me to see either arrow slit. Yes. Ding ding. Ah! Oh, there's one of the ah! gremlins. All right, everyone, okay. roll initiative. Looks like a king oh, here we go, guys. Twelve. <gasps> I just oh. ro rolled a one on my initiative. Two. Oh, do I get a? I get a plus one, so two. Oh, oh um, four. Still twelve for me. <laughs> all right. Uh, so whenever we do initiative, um, because I'm dealing with all their initiatives as well. If you could, if you guys could just hold out on until I call out your names okay. for it. Got it. Oh, okay. All right. Um, Ada. Two. Two, Zyla. Four. Four, Bergamot. Twelve for me, baby. Twelve. Wait. I got nothing. Oh. <laughs> all right. All so I would just like to point out that twelve is the critical best out of, initiative roll out of everybody. Yeah, I see that. Everybody I see that because we we can see the uh, gremlins on mm. there too. Oh yeah. We can see their initiative. That's really cool. Can you see that up there? Too? Okay, that's really cool. Yeah, we didn't cool. see that last time we played. I'm glad that we got that now. All right. Uh -oh. So, um, you guys are obviously uh, Bergamot. What do you want to do? And right. you can hold your action as well. Um, I mean, I only have about six seconds to figure this out, but we have already opened a door with a trap on it. And these guys are the guards. Their only job is to attack us. I see no reason that I shouldn't just start firing. Or else anybody can instantly shout out no. Uh, my goal is to launch a crossbow at, um, I'm gonna launch at uh, this one at the bottom of the screen. Uh, All right. my, my range is 100, so um, that I'm one? good. Uh, 14 plus my one attack bonus, so that is no, 15. Wait. Attack bonus is that? Is that when like the actual damage on attack bonus, or is that to your roll to attack? Attack, attack bonus, your you base attack bonus is to your roll to hit. Okay, got it. Um, so, and then yeah. like yeah, I said, strength. That right. So okay. base attack bonus is your base attack bonus. That is okay. your base attack. Melee weapons also add your strength bonus. You guys don't have strength bonus. I don't think any of you guys I've have strength I've got a strength bonus, bonus oh. from the pal of one. to 12. Yeah. 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 So, what are you attacking? Where? I am firing a crossbow Thank bolt. You. You're trying to fire into a tiny little, like, eye slit? Um, 
Yeah, I've got really good night vision. That's all he can do. I mean, shouldn't we try to like run and make it? If there's see if there's any doors or anything. I'll be it's honest. Like, no, because they're is, gonna alar alarm everyone else. But if I'm how not mistaken, could they, how could they hit us if we're directly underneath them? Is what I'm wondering. Well, you should run underneath them. I'm probably. I'm gonna I'm go. launching this. Uh, I mean, if we're attacking, I have a short bow. I'm, I'm already firing. I've already rolled. Okay. Yeah. Um, All right. So Anton is fired. Um, is a 15 hit? 15. Uh, not with their concealment. It hits the wall and shatters. So the way concealment works in Sagaborn to make it very simple is if a creature is at least 50% hidden behind an object, they attackers suffer a negative 2 on your attack roll. Mm -hmm. If the creature is fully concealed but still attacking, attackers suffer a negative 5. So I would say okay. that these guys are 50% hidden because they're like coming up trying to shoot you guys. Mm -hmm. So negative two isn't that bad, but. So I lost a bolt and do I have any um, remaining move? Uh, I, I can't recall if I'm allowed to move and so fire. As, so you haven't moved, you guys, combat started where you guys are at. So you could run and hide or try to run across the room or as your other action, you could start one of your bardic songs which would give everyone bonuses. Because um, you have the one. Remember, it costs no mana. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start singing this song. Um, I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty for some gremlin blood, and I want to sing a song entitled "Your Blood Is Like a Roller Coaster, Baby, Baby." I want to ride. Are you gonna sing it? Your blood is like a roller coaster, baby, baby. I want to ride. <laughs> the the sad part of it is it is uh, the red hot chili fawn version of the <laughs> no, it wasn't. Song. It clearly wasn't. <laughs> I resent that you get to decide the origins of my song. I'm the one who went to Bardic College. Okay, well, well in the future, the red hot what's chili fawns will do a cover yeah, of what's it a roller coaster? Right, right before they start, uh, you know, just singing ballads and. Uh, are the gremlins like, or the goblins like snickering from, <laughs> like, he's, we're about to go to battle and he's singing. Uh, no, um, so, so what is your, talking. so yours, that's Inspire Courage. What does Inspire Courage give everyone? Uh, inspire Courage, um, use song or poetics to inspire courage, uh, bolstering them. Uh, ally must be able to hear the bard, uh, last for five rounds. Uh, plus one morale bonus on saving throws against charm and fear, and a plus one morale bonus on attack and weapon weapons damage rolls. Inspire Courage is a mind-affecting ability. Cool. So, how do I roll for that? There is no roll. You just inspire, you start singing and nice. you inspire it's song. All of you guys, all of you guys uh, will, will be even you singing. I mean, you get happy with your own song. So you guys are rolling at a bonus. I like okay, that song. So I think I need to get, get little tokens for I like know. plus one and plus two, so you guys like can keep up with like. Yeah. Mm. Um, I got the, I got you. So oh, plus one morale go bonus. You. Morale right there. Oh, those are normally our mana tokens, but. Shh. Um, all right. So, one of the. Uh, those are really cool. What did you call it? Gremlins. Um, gremlins. Uh, uh, gerbil gerblins. Gerblins. I don't no, know. everyone says gremlins, but I like the mixture of gremlin Gob and goblin. Uh, gremlins. Gremlins. All right. Gremlins. So he fires a short bow out. Gremlins. 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 gremlins at, at Ada. Uh, Ada, what's your AC? Uh, uh tw twelve. Twelve. Mm -hmm. Yes, twelve. All right. The arrow hits you. Ow. And does four points of damage. Mm. Dang. Good thing you got those extra three. I know. All right, you Zyla, it's your turn. What do you do? Um, I, I really want to run, um, use my run skill, and I want to go to the wall, want? and I want to see if there's like any sort of right door, here? Wait, any sure. sort no, of wait. exits. Make sure she says where she wants to run. Where do you want to be? All right. I, I'm just going to like check down below here, because I don't think they can ah! hit me. Sorry, this is all new to me. And I want to just check for exits in case. Where do you want? Where do you want to be? Just point um, to the square you want to be down at. Down here is fine. I'm starting down there, and I'm going to go up, kind of up, to see. Oh, if so you any. ran down there, and then you're going to run some more? No, that's all. Unless you're just running this turn, because you only have a movement speed of 20. Oh, so I you, see that's, this. 
is looking in this That's arrow right. slit mm -hmm. at this entire chamber. Mm -hmm. uh, That's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, so, I just want to get down there so I can okay, see yeah, that so that's where you can move. Exits. But give me a, uh, where is it? One of us got to the door. We would An acrobatics safe. check, because this floor is very slippery. Is that a straight 20? Yeah. All right. That makes so it a you 24. Start, you start to, to slip, and then you just go with it, and so you just I, slide. Like, tumble, tumble, yeah. gracefully, like so gracefully. You elfling walk right across to wherever you want to go. Just <laughs> backwards? Like, not, like, not like Legolas when he's just like stepping on stones in midair. <laughs> we don't speak of bad no. effects movies. <laughs> yeah, that was awful. You'd have to grow some I bad stubble for that. I step on a few goblin heads on my way. Wait, where are those? Oh. All right, so you get right there, and uh, so you just you just want to look around for stuff. I want to like kind of go up and down this wall to see if there's any doorways. Oh uh, no, there is a doorway. There's yeah, a metal right doorway this, right in the middle. Okay. If, if well, one I'm of gonna us... like go ahead and like check for traps and stuff if I can. All right, so you gotta you guys. You... I want to get that door ready for us in case we need to like right. go through it. So you can move up to there, and then that's the end of your action. Okay. Yeah, if one of us is in front of the door, we would probably be safe from arrows. And then yeah. you could work on the door. Okay. All right. All right. Awesome. And then to fighting Ooh, gremlins. Gremlins. Yeah. Gerblin. Gerblins. Gerblins. No. Goblins. Gremlins. Goblins. <laughs> All right, so um, Zyla moved up and. I know I was about to check for traps. Yeah, but you couldn't because you right. made two move actions. Right. So next up, the. I gracefully flipped. Other. I just got hit. Gremlin the in the window shoots at Ada as well. So I remember you have the um. And that water. hits. Um. um and it does damage. two points of damage as the arrow sinks into your thigh. Uh, wait, so his uh, bardic inspire courage. inspire courage does, does that not take... affect AC? No. Okay, dang it. But so it, how much damage? Um, uh, two damage. Ah. Oh, oh, I was reading the card wrong. I'm sorry. Ah. All right, Ada, is now your turn. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Can I get to the door? Yes, you can, but I don't you, you have see any that long you, range weapons. Though. You should get out of range of but the arrows. But you have your spells. You have your wild magic that you could try, or. But you can also just I, get out of range of those arrows. They're arrow probably slides. more than a. Um, so, days it says this enchantment clouds the mind of a creature with a four or fewer hit dice, but those guys are probably more than four. Get over this door. Okay. Mm. Uh, at, actually, do in, in gaming wise, they everything? probably don't. What? Four hit dice is a lot. That's like a level four creature. You oh, well then, um, can I daze them? Yes. Uh, do I have to roll for that? So, how many creatures can you? Um, it's just one, correct? Uh, this enchantment clouds the mind of a creature with a four or fewer hit dice. Okay, so that of a creature. Okay. Yeah. So, um, it, it will be... It loses its next action and suffers negative two to all rolls during And what the is round. the save at the top under the stats? It'll say, like, will will negates or... Does it say any of that? Round, or duration, one round, casting okay. time, standard action. I, I think it's will negates on that one, so it has to be uh, a... Uh, spells all have a save DC, so, like... Zero mana spells have a 13, one mana spells have 14. Okay. So the goblin has to roll a 13 or above on a uh. will save. And it rolls a 12, minus 1, 11. So it is dazed. Awesome. And which All one right. did you want to do that to? Um, I was going to do just the one on the bottom, um, like closest to Xyla, I guess. All right. <laughs> Wait, I thought there was a... Oh. So there's like lower slits and higher slits? No, Am no, I no. able to move as well? The slit, as if well? you're looking at it from an angle, uh, like, like... What's that? Can I move? Yeah, it's like this. Yeah, you, if you're so standing you cast an angle, a, now you can move. This way, you can okay. go straight Okay, can I move it. to the so door? Like, I thought they were just like... Uh, yes, and you'll have to make a no, uh, acrobatic save because you're moving across the slick floor. Okay, um, d20? Yes, and add your acrobatics to it. Hmm. 
Uh, 9 plus 2, 11. Do I get plus with him or no? No. Um, no, I don't. No, it's saving so throws 11. against... 11? Alright. You slip and you almost slide towards the hole, but you make it. Uh, where do you want to go next to Zyla? Yes. Am I able to be like right... Oh! Wait. Yeah, just up against the door. Right there? Let's see. Can um, I be there or no? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you could have moved there Don't in 30. Fall into the hole. I, I'm trying, <laughs> okay? It is Stay a slippery floor, slippery slope. Uh, Burger Mott, what, what do you want to do? All right, my, I know what I want to do, which is run right up to the slit of where that um, gremlin was firing from. Gremlin? Um, gremlin is what Groblin? I wrote. Gremlin? Oh. <laughs> uh, um, uh, but um, do does the um, my disadvantage of shooting through a protected the closer I get does that take that away like if I run right up to that hole and try and fire my crossbow through do I have a better chance of success? Um, let's say let's put it this way uh, it's up to you and then the uh, uh, gremlin has the exact same bonus that you do. Right, because now I feel like I they would am. be able to hit you. Or yeah, so, yeah, so if it gets no concealment yeah. bonus, you get no concealment bonus. But I could still then, after... Oh, no, I already used my action. Um, no, but I'm saying, if you run up there and shoot, like, and you think that he doesn't get a bonus for ducking down, then you don't get a bonus for ducking down. But if you want a bonus for ducking down out of the way, then he gets the same bonus. He's dazed right now, right? Mm -hmm. And what does yes. that do to him? Um... Uh, okay. Negative two to all rolls. Um, yeah. Okay. It I... loses its next action. Um, okay. Negative two to all rolls during that round. Creature of five or more. I'm doing it. Running up, uh, crossbow ready, and I am firing. I, um, and I'm just saying because I would still say that he's still concealed. Even if you're shooting in a window, he's concealed. But we can negate his concealment bonus if you yeah. want to negate it on yourself as well. Done. All right. I'm gonna have to save your ass again. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be our our, our thing because you love me, right? Sure. Sorry. <laughs> you know her don't for even know each ten other. days. <laughs> What's going on? She healed me once before. I took it as a sign of love. <laughs> it's an obligation. <laughs> Note to all people <laughs> that <laughs> if you heal Bergamot, he thinks you love him. <laughs> I'm I'm easy. Sixteen. And I get a... Plus one from plus your song, one. 17. Oh, plus my base attack, plus one? Yep. So, 18. All right, that hits. Yeah. Nice. And so I roll a d8 because that is my crossbow. Yep. Oh, yeah, I haven't rolled this one yet. Two! <laughs> plus no, one. No, I don't think there is anything. For inspire, damage, yes. Oh, yes. yes. So it's plus one, so it's three. So, uh, three points of damage on the gremlin. Groblin. Groblin. I'll write that down too. <laughs> Alright, so you run up and he's looking a little glassy eyed, and you just shoot him <laughs> right in the chest. <laughs> and and uh, do, do you wanna do you wanna say anything as you do this? Um Yeah, actually wait, I saw him smile earlier, right? Yeah. Okay, and I'm eyeing his teeth. So uh, I wanna I wanna chime in with another little song where uh, it's gonna be something I'm interested in. I like teeth all of a sudden, so... <laughs> you should collect his teeth, too. Add it to your shark tooth. Tear the tooth shark. off, we're gonna tear the tooth oh, off his mother tooth. sucker. Spider tear the tooth, tooth off the sucker. Tear the tooth off, we're gonna tear the tooth off the mother sucker. Tear the tooth off the sucker. <laughs> mother sucker. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but there's one thing that we missed. Uh, roll, roll an athletics check because you ran across the slick floor. Oh, okay. no! <laughs> Twenty. Hey, was one. he sliding and shooting at the right. same time? Yes, correct. <laughs> Just like you described it, I'm actually like sliding with he's one like foot forward. Taking out his arrows as he's sliding, and he's like, mm. Just I'm, I'm sure singing. there's a hair flip yeah. in there somewhere. Like, yes. <laughs> oh. oh wait, no, I have to part my hair so I can see. Don't do the like. <laughs> oh, you, you can do it if you like. No, you like okay. So, so you do this. Yes. Yeah. Just like that. I love Just it. Just like that. Your forward moonwalk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yes! This is so epic. All right, so next up is one of the goblins. Wait, so I uh, I did hit him? Yes, you did hit him. All yeah, right. No, I said you hit him in the chest. Okay, I, I didn't, I didn't hear um, like anything exciting, like he like grunted or anything like that. No, no, I said that you sh just ran up and shot him in the chest, and then you got to sing your song. That was the exciting part, was that okay. you got to sing Good after song. you just ran up and shot the dazed guy in the chest. <laughs> I'm still looking um, at his teeth. His life is a musical. Um, do we... Um, do we need to take my uh, number down one because one round has passed? No, as long as you can still keep singing, as long as which I think you can keep going as a free action, <laughs> as long as you're not silent. So oh, we'll and I am sliding because his blood is like a roller coaster. I want to slide. <laughs> well, it's not gushing blood into you. No, I'm it. sliding. <laughs> I already announced that that's that's what his blood makes me do. This is all canon. So um, the the other one. Uh, uh, the, the other goblin, well, you guys wouldn't be able to see this, disappears out of the arrow slit, but then you Shit. actually see him you fucker. climbing up the wall, and they have uh, very elongated limbs, uh, but, but he's wait, still but on the other like side. they're like my of the size, so yeah. they're not really that big, right? Proportional. Yeah, but, but if your arm reached down to your ankles... Yeah. Like, it, like an orangutan. So it's just, it's climbing up, but it takes its full round action. It's actually now up near the roof, looking down at you guys. But is he on our side of the wall? or? On it doesn't the... matter now, because the wall is sort of broken down. Like, he's up, oh. and you can see him all the way up there. But it took okay. both of his move actions him. to get up there. Zyla, it is your turn. Wait, he went through the slit? No, 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 he climbed right up the okay. Remember, the tower is falling apart. There's okay. no roof. Yeah. Okay. Um... Oh, this is good. Um, and remember, they're both still days. Well, it's like up on top now. Yeah, he's way up top, yeah. I'm Wait, is he still to shoot... within range? Yeah. I'm going to try to shoot an arrow at him. Yeah, I mean, because he's, like, I mean, he's only like 20 feet up. Okay, so. Now that I'm not trying to shoot into any slits, like I can just shoot it straight up at it. All right. Okay. Use my short bow. That's a 13. 10 plus, or plus. I did the plus one. Okay, I did plus two and plus one. Okay. 13, 13. with your short bow? Yeah. Uh, you miss. The arrow flies out Shit. the roof of the... Shit. Nice try. ...of the building. That means one arrow. I know. I'm like, I hate it every time I erase an arrow. Can you, like, pick your arrows back up? I did one of my last ones. I... All right, um, so next up is the one in the doorway that just got shot in the chest and Bergamot's just sitting there singing in the arrow slit right at him and he, he lifts up his bow and just fires it point blank at Bergamot and rolled an 8 plus 5 that would be 12 what's your AC? 16 baby and it hits you right in the chest but it just breaks on your armor I have armor all that fur. Scale mail. I have, I have full armor. Fur mail. Mm -hmm. No, well, it's actually Dread it's mail. Like, it's it's really oh. knotted into my. So like scales and then fur and then. Fur oh, it's actually all right. Ada, you are so up thick. next. Oh. Um. Um. I wasn't even realizing. Uh. Just run up to the hole and stick your dagger right in his face. I'm not going to do that. I've already taken like oh, yeah. like six points of damage. Um, I would totally do that. <laughs> yeah, you would, but I'm the one that's supposed to save you guys. <laughs> if all I mean... Work on the door. You're safe. I guess, yeah. I guess I'll work on the door. Yeah. Can I'll you check it for traps or anything? I don't really have that ability. I already did that. I mean, not this door. No, 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 oh. no. Zyla, you did. You, yeah. No, 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 no. You said you wanted to. Instead, you just shot the arrow. Yeah. At him. All right. Crap. Well, but you didn't move. You could. Let's say you can check for traps. You could shoot the arrow. You miss. You go ah, and you start searching around for traps. Okay. All right. So roll, yeah. roll fever check. Oh, that's far. That's fine. Nine. Nine. 
I uh, don't notice any looks, traps. Looks clear. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way, hand me the dice tower. If you're not going to be using my fancy dice tower I gave you, I'm going to use it. Here's this one. I don't need two. I just need one. Here. Here's a dice tower. I didn't even notice it was there, and I'm probably not going to use it. So. Yeah, the metal dice wreak havoc on the wooden dice tower, yeah. so I would... Oh, do they actually damage it? Yeah, that that's not very... That's thick balsa wood. wood. No, it's not balsa wood. I think it's poplar, maybe? Mm. It was a special... He, he gave us a special like wood. like poplar. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And actually, she just rolled a two on her wood knowledge <laughs> check, but she just played it off as if... It smells like wood glue. All right, so Ada, just so you know, Zyla checked the door and says, Looks clear. <laughs> I guess... I guess I'm going to try to, like... <laughs> oh jeez! <laughs> I guess I'm gonna try to open it then. All right. Do, do how do you try to open it? Do the same trick. Oh no! <laughs> you should check for traps. Check too. the door. <laughs> I'm gonna check the door. Check the door. Yeah. All right. Roll check awareness. Check traps. Where awareness check? Seventeen plus two, nineteen. There you go. Looks pretty clear. It looks like a metal door. That happened okay. to me once. Um, I guess, can I open it? Sure, how do you want to open it? Uh, there is a handle on it. With the handle, please. <laughs> Alright, so you turn the ancient handle and try to push on it, <gasps> and it doesn't move at all. It what feels like there's pulling? something butted up against the other side oh, of it. shit, okay. Now, if you have a guard door, you want it to open in because otherwise the hinges would be on the outside, which makes it very easy to not be able to take door. the door no, off. To self, got it. So I'm gonna at least at least say there's something blocking this door, and I guess that's my turn because I don't Ooh. really. All right, Bergamot, it is your turn. You have a grappling hook and rope. I do. We you can go up throw over. it over mm -hmm. the wall. I thought of that. Yeah. Um, yeah. So Bergamot, you are having a stare down with this goblin, <laughs> just firing <laughs> arrows back and forth. What are you gonna do? Your turn. Um, what, um, tell me again, uh, the dimensions of this arrow slit. You couldn't fit through it, but, you know, I mean, it's... But would the, would the, uh, Gremlin fit through it? No. No? It's got a big, round little head. I couldn't make it fit? Phrasing? Yeah. Uh, you can try to pull it through if you want to, yeah. Is that what you want to do? I mean, it's on, it's on my mind. I was thinking, like... My first thought was use my grappling hook to go up and over the wall, but I was like, what if I could just, like, like, I'm so close, I could literally just hook him with my grappling hook, and, I mean, it'd be Wait, messy. Oh, through the slit? Yeah! Uh, I'm, like, uh, I'm trying to go big. Will the goblin fit through he's the a, slit? He's a gremlin. Groblin? All right, so oh, groblin. Um, groblin, gremlin, or I, or oh, if or you want to do just... that, if you want to do that, I would say that it's going to be a heroic action. Um, which would be uh, your strength or dex versus his strength or dex. Um, and for anyone watching, uh, Sogborn has a thing called heroic actions, which are especially for things like this, where you want to do something special instead of having some crazy rule set that you need to know for... Uh, normally I say it's for grappling, like wrestling, but you're actually grappling, but in a different way. Uh, so it just ends up being a roll off against the game master. So we'll both roll d20. We'll okay. add the stat bonus that we like, and uh, we'll see who wins out. So I'm, he's going to go with his dex, which gives my, him my strength and dex are the same. Right? Yeah, so, so you just got to roll well. Nine, sixteen. Okay, and it doesn't so matter if you, I add my two to nope. that. So you uh, swing your grappling hook through, clock. and you're you're singing songs about the goblin. <laughs> you are so cocky, and he just backs up, and it just hooks on the windowsill, and you're yeah. like, oh. so disappointed. So can I use a movement to perhaps um, duck out of the way afterwards, or did I use my heroic action, and that was? Does a heroic uh, action allow for a follow up, or is that like my my turn? Uh. We'll say for that one that you could then duck down if you want to go with concealment bonus again. I mean, I feel like I kind of just blew that one, so I might want to at least. <laughs> right. like, the I don't. But, like, ducking behind. I want, I want to stay within range. But right. Want, yeah. You'll just. I you'll be duck. under concealment, but your grappling hook is now stuck through the window, uh, which you'll have to deal with as an action later on. It's okay. I've got a grappling hook too. Okay. <laughs> All right. The the <laughs> goblin that's high up on the wall. 
looks down at Xyla after having shot, and he pulls out his short bow and fires down at her. Wait a second. What is he holding on to if he's using his Exactly. Is he standing on the wall? Oh, that's Um, a good question. You said he was on the ceiling. uh, How is he on the ceiling? No, roll a a knowledge check. (laughs) Roll a knowledge check. For me? No, no, on bardic knowledge over there. Oh, okay. Wait, I can do that while I'm ducking. I just happened to glance up. Yeah, yeah. What is he doing up there? It is, it is you, Anton. That's exactly how it would happen. Twenty natural. Oh, shit. All right. So the way this goes down is he slips and Bergamot hooks in, goes down. The goblin up top starts aiming like that, and he is like just perched his back against the wall, his feet up against uh, the wall, and both of you guys are like what? And Bergamot's like, oh yeah. So these must be those Arnak spider goblins, the ones that. Can climb as if they're spiders. Spider goblins. And he goes down and down. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I hope that was a good approximation of your voice. That makes I couldn't have done it better. Uh, like, oh, yeah, all baby. Spotted. Yeah, I totally know those goblins. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and so, <laughs> so uh, uh, with a natural 20, it's like, it's like you're opening up a book. You're opening up like the Wikipedia of this creature. <laughs> um, so, so now you actually know a lot about your guys' foes. Uh, they, they live with spiders and they raise spiders. Uh, they have elongated limbs which allow them to crawl so spider-like spider. everywhere. They're not really part spider, but they... Can they like they're stick like, a little bit? Yes, yes. So it'd be like cousins. if there's like a superhero called Spider-Man in this world, it would be like Spider-Man. Like they don't, they can't shoot okay. webs out or anything. But so that means that these things are very, they can crawl walls the same speed that they can run across the floor. Oh, oh my so gosh. Shit. Okay. I don't know if I'll be I mean, grappling snap. up on your walls anytime. Alright, Xyla, it is your turn. Ooh, we're ghosted over Ooh, here. I was gonna um well, what do you do you guys think I should try to about it? Throw my grappling hook up the wall and climb up or should I just That's like, pretty much your best option take a shot. shot. The or shoot. Shoot. Yeah, let's Shoot's shoot. gonna do damage. Grappling yeah. is gonna leave you vulnerable because you'll yeah. be hanging from it's a rope while it's he's true. shooting at you. Just shoot. Yeah. Mike, um, we're ghosted right. over here. Okay. Here we go. We'll just look back here. God! What is that? Two. two. A two? It's not going to matter what I add to it. Yeah. So what were you doing? Shooting an arrow. Shooting an arrow? Another arrow, Another just like, arrow. just whips. I'm really bad at this. Right past. I'm going to go collect those arrows. Yeah, you got to go like, back. I'll tell you what, you do that while I'm getting my grappling hook. <laughs> Alright, um, the other goblin disappears out of the arrow slit and climbs up the other wall. Ah! Frap. Frap? Frap. Frap. Um, so next up, Ada. Okay, um, there's not much I can actually do. You have, uh, your wild I guess, magic. I guess I can, yeah. I can either daze or wild magic. So wild magic says a burst of energy explodes from the wilder's hands towards a target. You must mm-hmm. succeed at a ranged touch attack. Is it a ranged touch attack if they're on the ceiling though? Yeah, a ranged touch attack means it's the same as shooting an arrow, but instead of dealing with their armor, it's just you just have to touch them. So it's actually much easier for okay. you to make that hit. Awesome. Well then, I guess I'm gonna use wilder magic on. I guess the one that Anton's already shot. Is he peeking up over the wall? Yeah, they're both up above now. Okay. Cool. Then I'm gonna um, go for the one that Anton's already shot. All right. Uh, roll an attack roll. D twenty plus. You're still getting your plus from Anton singing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I never stopped. Fifteen plus so sixteen and then yeah, yep. sixteen. All right. Uh, that hits. What? By the way, did nice. we talk last time? What color is your wild magic? You get to like. You have an energy color. It could be a combo what? of colors too. What? You totally get to make that up. Yes. I don't even know. Okay, just pick one for now when you can think about okay, it later. Okay, it's gonna as you be feel. about like this color. Gummy worm color. No, All right. this color. Purple and blue? Like purpley blue green ish. Yes. Mm. Like earthy colors with a like hint All of right. purple. So uh, and a bit of iridescence it looks like. Yep. So your energy blasts out from your hand, a uh, bluish-greenish bolt of energy 
uh, catching it in the throat. Roll nice. damage. Yes. Damage is 1d4. Plus, you get uh, plus one damage. Okay. damage. 1d4. Two, three points of damage. Three? Alright, uh, you hit it in his neck and you see it let loose from the ball, wall and fall down with a crash. Does he take damage when he falls? That's uh, 20 feet. You don't know. All you know is that he let go of the wall and fell down. Do we hear him like grunt a little bit when he lands? Um, you, he doesn't Do you sound like he doesn't. Are you gonna sing no. about it? Oh, the other side. I don't have a song you don't hear him for grunting, you but don't. I will next time. Uh, well, the thing is, it's your turn, so you could actually peek in through the arrow slit if you wanted to. Oh, it's my turn? Yeah. Mm, I'm, I, I'm gonna have to peek in because, uh, well, I can't tell on this. Is he... Yeah, I can see him, right? Uh, yeah. You, you, no, you can't see him because you're ducked down. Are you gonna peek in or not? Well, I mean, like, it looks as though... Are you gonna are, peek or not? Yes, I'm peeking. All right, so you pop up, you look in, and he's face down in a bunch of, uh, like... Refuse and, and trash. Dirty gremlins. Refuse as in like he kind of shit himself. No, no, like there's a pile of trash there. Okay, that he okay. Out there. I had to clarify. We'll we'll learn <laughs> once we check his body whether he like sharded a little bit when he landed. Yeah, Alright, okay. so what do you want to do, Anton? Uh alright, I'm standing up to peak, so I'm obviously shooting again. Alright, so you wanna shoot your crossbow at the other one that's up on the other side? Oh, wait, no. I'm a I, terrible shot, so you got to go for that guy. Oh, yeah. I'll, yeah, I'll take yeah. the one up. Yeah, totally good call. Okay. Uh, seven. Seven? Yeah. You fire, Lost and it sticks. There, there's very all little left of arrows. the roof. Very little left of the roof, but there's one little old age beam, and your bolt just goes right into that bolt. You're not getting that arrow back. Not that one. Sorry. All right. And the one up top fires its arrow down at Bergamot. 13 plus 5 is 18. What's your AC? That's a hit. Oh, I get a plus 1. Um, no, that's just, uh, that's on my tax. Saving throw? Oh, yeah. Saving and it throw. does 4 points of damage. The arrow slams down uh, into the meat of your shoulder and just mm. like, is just sticking out. So oh. meaty. Do you want me to break that off for you? All right, Zyla. I'm, I'm keeping this. Um. Well, I'm gonna try to hit it again. All right. We'll see how it goes. Third time's the charm, right? <laughs> twenty. A real twenty? Yes. yes. All right. Yes. So like what? Twenty-four. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, is that when we so get the special? That's an attack, right? Yeah. Oh, so we get to uh, to do the, the critical hit? Do I yep. get to say what part of his body it hits? <gasps> um, roll a d20 again and we'll see what you get on the... Okay. Two. <laughs> Two. <laughs> Two? You hit his toenail. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Wait, this is not bad. Pluses for... No, no, that's just seeing where it lands on the list here. Oh, All right, unstoppable okay. force, okay, double that. damage, and you knock the target prone. Yes. So roll, when it's double damage, you actually roll two of the dice. So you're, oh, it's shit. 1d6 well, and roll. Well, do I get, still get just, just one plus one, or do I get two no, plus No, you ones? get two plus one. So roll 2d6 okay. plus two. Um, well, I was thinking about rolling these fancy Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. these Yeah. Those non regulation. Yeah. <laughs> They're made so of That's a five and a three. Five and a three. Wait. Are you, right. I'm adding plus one, plus one. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So we'll hey. do a shot to Zyla finally hit something. A shot. Yay. And then she really hit. <laughs> a shot to being drunk? Yeah. So, um, you you shot, you hit him, yes. uh, double damage, and knocked him prone. Uh, is there any description you want to give to how your arrow flew? Um, well, I want to say it hits him through the gut, and he falls off of the wall, and then it 
like he falls on the arrow and it goes oh. all the way through. Ooh. Wait, where does all it come right. out? Where does it come Comes out? Comes out of his butthole! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Is, I don't know so, how that happens, but <laughs> it does because it went in an, at an angle. We have now established so, that. So basically, what, what, what I'm imagining is, is all of Zyla's attacks are going to be like a fortune cookie. That, you know, like instead of in bed, it's like out the butthole. Like every every so time. It, it basically exactly like that. it basically like went in like this and it's hot. Okay, I'm just you're shooting from below. There's no way that it could. Okay. Well, it goes it, in his belly button hole. <laughs> well, it, uh, it's fine. It, we will make it fiction. <laughs> we will make it. Yeah. Yes. Hey, you know what? What if he was on the wall like Spider Man, standing out like yeah, you know, like yes. that? He yeah, could have been. All right, he, he was, was upside down. Like, so, so what, what was the damage? Like this. What was the because, damage that you rolled? Um, five was, and three. Five and three. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So. Uh, it does hit him in his gut, and he does let loose and falls to the ground. And though none of you are at the arrow hole to see this, so it's really sad because he actually slams down so hard that the arrow does pop out of him and flies oh. up a little bit, and then turns back down and comes and sticks in his left cheek. Yes. Oh, wait, wait, yeah. wait. Yes. This cheek? No, no, because no. he landed face first. So just your lower out, cheek for the satisfaction of our watchers. out the xyla hole and then right next to it. <laughs> That's good storytelling right there. I had right no there. idea when I came on this adventure with you guys that I would love to shoot things and make them come out the buttholes. <laughs> wait, that's not even crazy. You're that's learning just... a whole new thing about yourself. All right, hold on. Out of character, not a surprise to any of us. 